Hi guys, it's a nice day, but I still don't have a place to live, which is why I'm going to continue talking about trafficking, modern slavery, um, forced prostitution. These women with Betsy Capel were involved right from the start with my ex-husband and his coke dealing business. I didn't realize that. Um, this went on a long time. There was lots of jokes and parties behind my back that I'd be invited to. They would pick fights. The violence was just constant. Um, but I was always blamed for it. I was always blamed that I wasn't part of the group. Um, my ex sold a lot more coke than I understood at the time. Um, you know, he told me he did a little coke in the 80s with my, uh, my cousin who got into heroin. He died young. Um, he had a bad heroin addiction. Um, he had sexual, he had sexual, uh, dis sexual abuse problems. He molested me as a child. Um, long story short, these people were involved from the beginning, um, playing this game to fraud me out of these assets. Um, and this is how trafficking can start. It can start with someone pretending to be your boyfriend. Um, and why it took me so long to figure it out is because these women constantly lied about him. Uh, they were constantly involved with his coke business. Uh, they're, they're organized. They get together. Uh, and they set up your boyfriend. Uh, or they pass you off. Or they set you up at a Super Bowl party, which was what happened to me. And then everybody plays along. Uh, this Betsy Capel has made uh, 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 threats about my mental health. Now, her sister Allison was down to Russo's. I know you won't recognize all these names, but these women continue to stalk me, harass me, make threats. Um, it's uh, resulted in the loss of everything I had, everything. They even tormented my dog with dog fighting that he'd be bait dog because he was a toy breed. Uh, they harassed him repeatedly, uh, abused him. Um, so this is ongoing here, and this has been ongoing. They set up this sexual assault. And this is what these women are capable of. And we need to all speak out and we need to say no more of this. This Bessie Cup Hell is violent. I believe she has mental health issues. She's done this repeatedly. They all knew they set up and were involved in my marriage. It was a joke. After they were all together involved with his coke business, they all used to go up to this Butternut Falls and party with these, this Jackie Daly and other people. And they pretended they don't know each other. They pretended they weren't friends. They all used to hang out at this at the bar, the annex with the Lanzies. You know, so coke dealers and these kinds of horrible, violent criminals are protected in our community. These people work for the city. She works for the city hall. Be safe out there, guys.